Federal government says train services will not resume on the Abuja-Kaduna route on Monday as earlier projected. Minister of Transportation Maazu Sambo disclosed this to newsmen in Kaduna on Sunday during an inspection tour to assess the state of readiness of Abuja Kaduna Rail Services before the commencement of operations. He also announced the introduction of some security measures and precautionary guidelines such as the use of national identity number for passenger profiling which is now compulsory. Take a look. There is no specific date for the resumption though the Minister of Transportation is hinting that it may not be more than a week. It is therefore no surprise that plans are at an advanced stage in anticipation of the resumption of the rebranded Abuja Kaduna bound train services. The Minister led an inspection tour from Idu Abuja to Rigasa Kaduna on Sunday amidst heavy security to assess some of the security measures put in place. I know. For obvious reasons, the Minister of Transportation is keeping some of the security strategies close to his chest. That has been put in place, but we are not going to tell you what we have done. It is a security matter, okay. and I have no apologies for that. But he does let the public in on some of the plans, such as the identity verification devices, which have been already deployed at each Nigerian Railway Corporation train station to confirm the validity of each passenger ticket and identity before they can get access to departure lounges. We have introduced a new system before you buy a ticket. The purchase of a ticket requires you to provide a phone number and a national identification number in order to profile because that is the beginning of the security checks so at any point in time when a train moves from one station to another we know who and who are on board if you don't have an nin you are not going to board our train it's as simple as that if you are a minor an adult will pay for you will register for you and an adult can only register for not more than four minors. Now, we want to give sufficient time for the Nigerian public to listen to this, to, uh, 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 what do you call it, to, 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 to assimilate this new system. So if you start tomorrow, a lot of people will be disgruntled. The minister, flanked by the Minister of Water Resources, Suleiman Adamu and Minister of State for Transportation, Ademola Degoroye, assures Nigerians that protection of lives and property of passengers is paramount. I will tell you that whatever is humanly possible to put to secure the lives of the users of this uh, service have been put in place. And we will continue to upgrade it. We'll be monitoring it on a daily basis and improve on whatever, wherever we find some snacks. Recall that on March 28th, the Abuja Kaduna bound train was attacked by bandits where some passengers were killed and kidnapped. Dashan Husseina Usman.